midday mayhem after eight LIRR train cars jumped the tracks just east of the Jamaica station. At least 100 passengers were on board, including this man. And the train just started bouncing all over the place. Everybody started screaming and yelling and then uh, stopped. Air 11 was over the scene of the derailment as emergency crews rushed in to get all of the passengers off the train. They were transferred to an adjacent train one by one, including a baby. From here, the rescue train took all of the passengers to Jamaica Station to be evaluated. In all, 13 passengers were hurt. And there was also a lady, she was pregnant, and she was just, she suddenly called her, uh, called her husband. Like, it was like, all of a sudden it happened. These two college students were also on board the train. In this cell phone video they shared with us, they tell PIX11 News you can see passengers remaining calm, but the students say they had no idea what to think. I thought that what if the train, like, it falls in a hole or something like that? What, what if, like, there was many thoughts going through my mind. So it just derailed and we just, everyone panicked and they said, like, run, run, and we ran. And then it's, it stopped, and then we were stuck in there like for two hours. During that time, the MTA, FDNY, and emergency crews went into investigation mode, checking the train and the tracks to assess the damage. Our crews acted immediately, immediately to protect the customers, do what they needed to do best to secure and make sure they were safe. Now our track department and our rec crew will do what they do best. They will assess the situation. They will get this train and these tracks up and running as fast as possible and as safe as possible. And let's just recap now. In total, 13 passengers were hurt, including two with serious injuries. But all of those passengers are expected to be okay. As far as the damage, well, the train stayed upright the entire time. The MTA says the damage is extensive. So what that means is your evening commute will be affected. You can expect delays and cancellations even into tomorrow morning. For now, we're live in Jamaica, Queens. Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.